Tom Brady is joining the NFL on Fox to become their next official head analyst for their NFL slate of games. This is a big-time announcement. Fox announced this morning that Tom Brady would be joining as their lead NFL analyst once he actually ends up retiring from pro football, which, as we found out this offseason, is not a guarantee. Uh, Fox Sports said in a statement earlier today that, quote, we are pleased to announce that immediately following his playing career, seven-time Super Bowl champion Tom Brady will be joining us at Fox Sports as our lead analyst. Uh, Tom Brady also tweeted out uh, earlier today about this announcement, quote, tweeting Fox's announcement, saying, excited, uh, but a lot of unfinished business on the field with the Buccaneers, LFG. You guys all know what that means. But Tom Brady, the man that retirement forgot, the man that father time forgot, the man who is who is still making his comeback in a weird way because he never really left when you think about it. He was retired for 40 days, comes back, and we are now officially know what he's going to be doing when he retires, and it's not going to be picking the kids up from uh, school and then and, and doing the, all the, the great domestic things and fatherly things that people honestly expected him to do. It is talk about football for a living. Um, and, and it's crazy. It's crazy. We, we know that Fox, they lost uh, Troy Aikman and they lost Joe Buck in their uh, in those negotiations that took place. Th- those two ended up going over to ESPN. They are now going to be the Monday Night Football crew. So now they had a bit of a hole as far as who they were going to have calling their games. And now at least we know for potentially the 2020, what is it, 2023 season, maybe 2024. Again, it all depends on when Tom Brady ends up deciding to hang it up. It's, it very well could be the case that Tom Brady, th- this upcoming season could be Tom Brady's last season be- because of the way that he retired, then came back. Uh, you know, maybe he felt like he had one more run in him. Uh, but 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 all signs do indicate, and I think this also helps indicate, that this could be Tom Brady's last season. Don't hold me to that because Tom Brady might just say, ah, I always have this Fox thing in the bank. They're going to want the greatest quarterback of all time. Sorry, they're going to want the greatest player of all time to uh, to call games, no matter what, no matter what it is. It could be 2027, and Tom Brady says, hey, I want to call games. They're going to want him. Absolutely, they're going to want him. And they're going to pay him big, big, big-time bucks. Uh, uh, here, here's another interesting tidbit from this story. This is from John Orond. Uh, John Orond says, sources say Fox began negotiating with Brady around the same time Aikman started his talks with Amazon and ESPN. So we know that the the the, the, the entire landscape of announcing in pro football, whether it be the Amazon thing with them getting uh, Al Michaels or this Brady announcement or, you know, obviously Aikman and Buck going over to ESPN. It's changed a lot of things, and and I think you know you you could argue it changes things for the better because I know a lot of people saw Troy Aikman and Joe Buck doing those those those, those sorry, America's game of the week, and we're like, eh, you know, Fox's thing isn't that great. Maybe Brady in twenty twenty three, twenty twenty four, whenever, whenever, uh, is going to shake things up a little bit, and and then that could provide a spark for Fox that they really do need in their presentation. I'm not talking about ratings. I'm talking about presentation. So it's going to be interesting. And look, he probably got paid a lot of money. We don't know how much he exactly got paid. But considering the fact that, you know, people like Joe Buck and Troy Aikman basically got quarterback money to go over and and uh, and go to ESPN, it could mean a lot. It could really mean a lot. Um the, the other note from this story is that Fox said that Brady will also serve as an ambassador for us, particularly with respect to clients and promotional initiatives. I think that this deal, like I'm not going to lie to you, considering everything, this is going to be well, well, well ahead of any other deal there is, is on the market. I could honestly see Tom Brady getting anywhere between 40 and $50 million a year if, if all of this is to be believed. And 
if we were wondering why Tom Brady was so eager to make this announcement, I guess now we know. Or, or I guess, I guess, I mean, that that would be a really good reason to be eager to make the announcement, make it official. Um, we know that this also, the, the way that Tom Brady's doing this, announcing this before he actually retires, is is not uncommon now. Like, I mean, Drew Brees did it with NBC before he became one of the analysts over there on NBC on Sunday Night Football. Drew Brees did this. So, very, I mean, I, I think that's that's just how it works now. This is how it works now. Quarterbacks are just going to get paid. Going to get paid. Uh, but Tom Brady joining Fox Sports. Wild, wild west. That is the announcing game in pro football. Let me know what you guys think about this. Hit that like button. Subscribe. Hit that notification bell so you get notified whenever a new video is released.